I'm if not. I'm dealing with Queens, I'm being straight with you and say, that's how we deal with each other. No game, no nothing. This is just what it is. No BS, no bad energy in my life. I'm not, do you, I don't have a girlfriend? Cause I don't have a girlfriend, I have a lie to her. I don't want to be lying all day. I'm keeping it real. Keep it real. I don't want to be committed to a queen right now if I can't be committed. I know I don't have that in me right now. I'm not in that phase. There, of course, that telling you I'm commit to you a lie all day and have that energy in my life every single day. If you're a man or a woman, you're a king or queen, and you're cheating on your significant other, and they think they're under different terms than what you live in, you live with bad energy every freaking day of your life. You got a cloud over you. Wondering why shit ain't going right. Because you got bad people, places, things, habits going on all around you. You ain't eliminated, you ain't evolved yet. You ain't evolved. So I live this. I evaluate daily what the hell I'm doing wrong. Honestly, in the mirror to myself, within my business. Then I eliminate those things. And after eliminating those things, I evolve to a better me daily. Constantly challenging myself to get better and better and better. Every day. How can I out the work more and more and more and more and more? And, more? and then, I execute, meaning I live out that new me. I live it out, I walk it. I evaluate, I eliminate, I evolve, and I execute. I walk the walk every day. And I've noticed, to be honest, bro, I can't say that, it's a king. I see the change in you. Many of you guys, you, you guys see my evolution. I'm sure you have. From the years of watching me and my brand, or whatever you've been watching, watching YouTube, Periscope, whatever, You've watched me evolve right before your eyes. And we'll continue to do so, to constantly evaluate, I'm constantly eliminating, I'm constantly evolving, I'm constantly executing. While functioning on a burning desire, big, bodacious goals, being intentional about those goals, and persisting. That's my, that's my blueprint. This is how I move. Every day I'm in my A++ games. That's the blueprint. So now you get the real estate knowledge, and you do this? Oh, you rolling. You rolling. It gets easy. You'll do what you gotta do to make things happen. You won't stop at interviewing one attorney. You'll interview three, five, seven, 12, 14, 16 attorneys. When I became the celebrity realtor up in Alpine, New Jersey, America's richest zip code, America's richest zip code, my three-time felon, Welfare kid ass, one of the Alpine, New Jersey, America's richest zip code, the richest town in the United States of America. I went up there and I took nine interviews in two days for finding a brokerage. Nine interviews in two days. Where most people are, oh, I'll take one, two, three, oh, they didn't hire me, all right, I'm going home and try something else. I took nine. I sold myself, got hired by Sotheby's, went there, created a brand, celebrity realtor. Had zero celebrity clients. It was cool. My goal was there. Then I went and I worked the work. It was intentional about that goal. Then brought my company's biggest listing into our Fort Lee office at $10 million. Me! Everywhere I go, no matter what market, no matter what goal, no matter what, same formula. But it's the persistence fact of what I do too. Most people will not outwork the work. You just, you'll stop. You'll stop yourself. You won't go see the fourth, the fifth, the sixth, or 20th person. You won't go to real estate investment meetings all week. Oh, Jay, where can I meet some, uh, where can I meet some cash buyers? <laughs> When's the last investment meeting you went to? How many LinkedIn groups have you hit up for private investors? How many Facebook meetings have you met up for private investors? Hey, Jay, where, oh, oh, where can I find an attorney? What the? You're asking me to find an attorney? You need me to tell you where to find an attorney? Hey, Jay, uh, you think I should get a real estate attorney? <laughs> this is what I said. This is what we're doing today. Teaching you how to think. We're here for real estate investing. Should you get a real estate attorney? Hmm. <laughs> you don't need the cosign. You don't need the crutch. To do something you already know is a smart thing to do. Even you asked me earlier, right? About the website? Uh, Who asked me earlier about the website? I do. King. 
Ask earlier, said, Jay, you think uh, having a website is necessary? What you think? I just want to know your personal opinion. I understand, but why do you know my personal opinion or something you already, what you think? I believe so too. Right, how many websites I got? A million of them. <laughs> you ain't got to ask a personal opinion. And I'm not saying to pick on you, you understand what I'm saying, though. No? I understand, yeah. We know what we got to do. We just want somebody co-sign and push and they just feel like, all right. But you already know. You already know. You co-sign yourself. So this is part of our, our formula. I want to get into two things when we look at the actual lessons. 